the shotgun could buy the hunting rifle, but um, it would be really good for where I'm at right now. Yeah, I guess I will. Be safe out there. Suda fifty one. Magic Tower? Yeah, right. Fifty one game. You and a uh Let's have sounds a familiar. I don't remember really though. Oh, this is where you can craft Spitfire. Is this a secondary? Flamethrower spews flames that will ignite targets with the burning effect, dealing 150 fire damage over 10 seconds. Hot shot. That's the. Uh, let's buy it. Why not? I've got work to do. Same people that made lollipop sh chainsaw. I'm thinking of. Uh, wait, shadows of the damned. Is that the? What do you need? I'm thinking of the game with the giants. I love weird games like that. I don't know if I'm thinking of the right thing. Oh wow. The Spitfire actually does a lot more damage than my current submachine gun and this is plus three. So if that's the case, I will which gun do I upgrade? Ideal range. I'm gonna upgrade the hunting rifle. Five. And then the sword. And that's gonna be it for right now, I guess. So long. Alright, let's swap these out. Oh wait, I've uh yeah, I forgot about that back shadow of the colossus that's what i'm thinking of right right hunting rifle uh let me take this off and then hunting rifle i'll equip that swap this out with the scrap sword does it go faster yeah i think it does It reminds me of the uh, vamp vampire, vampire weapon that you get also. The like hatchet that he holds on to. Also a great game. Still trying to remember Shadows of the Damned. Excuse me. Okay, I think this is this is definitely gonna help for the next area we're in. Vampire. That game was disappointing for me. Really? I, I really liked that game. Um, it's, I think it, my thing though is I'm a big fan of like RPGs. I'm, I am literally the worst person ever to take game advice because I find something good in every game that I play. So let me get that out there real quick. So a game that I find or like, like there's some very rare games that I actually like don't like because I usually find something at least in every game that I, I like or enjoy or, or something. So I, I sound like I, I like every single game. Um, but no, I know that game was buggy that it was kind of weird at some points. Um, but overall I, I did really really like it I love the fact that you could literally kill anyone but me being good in like all my playthroughs I never killed anyone so like I only ever killed uh, people that I had to or like bad guys but that game is like a, a literally a perfect game for anybody that wants to like go all out oh my gosh switching to this weapon is such a good choice for this area. Um, I think the hunting rifle was probably the best thing I could have done. 
equip this. Also, this guy. Does this last for 10 minutes too? Yeah, it does. Where is he at? Nice. Oh gosh. I think... Oh man. I think when you run around a few times, then it becomes easier the next times you go around. Or that there's less people that spawn. That's what it feels like, at least. What? Easier. Oh. <laughs> uh, I see it. Shadows of the Colossus. Sorry, I don't know why Streamlabs gets like that. Shadows of the Damned. Yo, that actually, lo it looks identical to this game. 2 to 51. Resident Evil series. Huh. Just looking at that cutscene, or the little picture. Yeah, no, I, I see the link. I, I, I just looked at it too. Uh, yeah, I don't know why. I tell Streamlabs only to purge the last post, but for some reason it's just like, um, no. Doesn't like that. I might be able to change that. There's like a, a certain, it, it only does that for people that are like, aren't in chat for too long. Um, I think there's like a certain amount of watch time and then afterwards it, it moves you to a different status and then it doesn't delete links like that, but I saw it. What the? Careful there. Thank God. This this area is definitely taking way longer than I actually should. I thought he was dead. Luckily the, I mean, if you get these guys pretty good, oh, they go down, but, um, the big guys are a little tough here and there. The dogs and the, the guys with the rifles go down pretty fast. Let me take this heal. some buffs now oh I see the end I forget I keep forgetting about the melee weapon too sorry I got distracted by my bro I had to oh one sec one sec oh god Let's 
it's so easy to get overrun. If you stop moving, it makes your accuracy so much better. I've had to show him the new epic rack battle with Steve Irwin, really? <laughs> That's interesting. Good old Steve. Oh, it's over. Is it actually though? It was pretty great. I haven't seen or, or watched an epic rap battle for a while. It's been a good amount of time. Oh, thank God. half tempted to uh, I'm still tempted to join another person's game oh no we have a boss coming up too oh here we go each boss is different too so I might be getting this guy but other people might get some somebody else or something else God. Burning. Oh no. I don't have my burning stuff enabled right now. Ah. Why? What is even going on? Oh no, take it quick, quick. <sighs> like hardcore Indiana Jones up in here, right? That's so true, though. Oh, no, I need to reload. Man. Oh, God. What? Bro. Fight back. All out. Really? Oh, worst time possible to be all out. Start dodging more. Oh, this is going to kill me. This is gonna kill me. I don't have a burn resistance equipped. It sucks because I'm I'm kind of close. I feel like this is a Kingdom Hearts boss. What is that? Like, what is that? Why do I... I take so much fire damage from that.
Oh, that's all my heals. Stop. I could have had him right there. Got him. Hey, he, he. First try. Oh, it's over. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> oh, you. It, uh, <laughs> that was nuts. Same. Same. Easy clap. <laughs> Not enough room. Oh, my gosh. Ah, uh, uh, got World Walker weapon. Let's go with. Uh, could I could let's take hit ten. That trail or trait dabbler. Switching to this uh Wait, did he, did the boss drop anything? Switching down to the hunting rifle for these was definitely a great decision. Now, the only thing is, eventually I want to switch back. Nice. Chipotle wall away. Ah, oh, joined the left game. Joined and he left. Get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Why tonight? Besides Mer. Appreciate you being here, man. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Seems like the, a lot of the enemies uh, here have been ranged. So for right now, I'm gonna hold on to my uh, my hunter rifle. This area, like the way this, I was saying uh, earlier, this area reminds me of like a mix of Spec Ops: The Line and also uh, like Max, Max, uh, not Max Payne, uh, Mad Max. I get some stuff done before work. I'll be lurking my friend. All right. No problem at all. Thank you very I really do appreciate you stopping by hanging out chatting and all that good stuff So, uh, I'll be here if you do hop back in but if if you do hop out at any point Thank you again for hanging out and thank you for following and all that I appreciate it Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no Oh no, oh no, oh no. I hate this thing. Get out of here. Oh, now we're back to these things again. What? And you still exist? I need some of those, uh healing things oh. Oh, oh right in the right in the hot spot one shot oh. took him down it's over. <laughs> yeah it was over yo this hunter rifle is like OP right now nice tome of knowledge I uh, take that.
This thing has been taking down the enemies a lot faster than my other rifle. I think, honestly, the hunter rifle might be the way to go uh, when you're playing solo. Because it's, it's been making a good amount of difference while using it. Um, but then probably when I play co-op, I'd switch to the, the other rifle um, that I was using before. The medium to the short to medium range. Probably can't go through here. Yeah, I, I figured. The one thing I don't like about the co-op, and it's probably my only complaint, is um, when they do join, you have to go to a stone in order for them to spawn. Um, every every time too so like if you're not near any type of stone they have to wait until you get all the way to the end of the area or go all the way to the beginning and then sit down um, that's kind of a bummer I mean it's not too bad it could be a lot worse uh, but it's still a uh, could be a little bit of a a pain. Uh oh. Alright, so these guys seem to take a good amount of damage. Oh, they don't, though. Pull away, pull away, lay away. There's stuff dripping. This game ha kind of has some like, uh, I mean, yeah, you could say Dark Souls enemies, but at the same time, it kind of has some like destiny esque enemies too which is pretty cool i mean like this area we're in right now reminds me of like the vex or like the taken i love how there's friendly fire even for the enemies oh gosh where'd she come from Nice. Oh, there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, <sighs> damn it. How many times have I died this session? I've died more times. Well, I, I guess technically my, my first session was by myself. But still, oh. Here they come. Man. I might make tonight's stream uh, a little bit earlier than than usual. Just because I, I kind of actually want to, um, so I've decided that, so I've been following, uh, Ka Carnage, um, probably a lot of you know who's, who he is, uh, I don't know if I said that correctly, but he's probably one of the streamers, he, although he's not my favorite streamer, he is one of the streamers that, um, I really like his take on games, how he plays them, um, He's friendly, his community is really nice. So he, he's somebody that I aspire to to be, essentially. Um, so that being said, I don't mean to copy him or anything, but I noticed that for his channel, um, he does upload his streams as Let's Plays onto YouTube. So with that, um, I think that could be very beneficial for myself. Um, so what I'm going to start doing is once these streams are done, 
uh, I'm gonna start downloading the actual file and then uploading it to uh, YouTube in 30 minute increments similar to what he does um, so that way it's kind of like I, I mean my original goal for YouTube was I wanted to make things that are specific for YouTube and then also have things specific for streaming but honestly I just it's with my current schedule with life and everything it, that's not one of the easiest things to do so probably my best option is if I want to put content on YouTube it's to export my videos there um, but not in the way where it's it's full just sort of let's play styles um, trim out some parts here and there also I, I wanted to originally make my YouTube um, where I don't have a webcam because I don't know I never really expected myself to ever really use one but if this is the the way that I end up doing it uh, I'm not gonna go out of my way and record it without the webcam so I would just upload it how it is um, did I just go out the way that I came in I think I might have actually yeah yeah I did crap Uh, I was too busy talking about YouTube then <laughs> I was paying attention to what I'm actually doing But I, I feel like it, it can work out. I mean if it does it cool if not Okay, it's there um, It's better than I think it probably is a lot better than not l uploading anything at all and then also doing it in 30 minute increments technically makes it like episodes so if somebody does want to watch for 30 minutes of a let's play they can if, if they don't then they don't have to um, I'm not interesting or anything like that like obviously they can just back out but it, it's there you know so it could potentially bring in more people to the actual stream to say what's up to come chat um, if they do realize that they like it so if you are watching this at that at this time on YouTube then definitely join in on the stream sometime. Feel free to chat. Um, say what's up. I play a, a, a wide variety of games. I'm always trying something new. I'm going back to old games, playing games in my backlog that I never played. Um, there's, yeah, <laughs> there's a lot of games I always wanna play and probably will. I think actually um, sometime soon, probably next week, I'm thinking about possibly playing uh, Gears of War 4 because, or Gears 4, however, whatever it's called. I don't know if it's Gears of War 4 or Gears 4, um, but I'm debating on playing it because uh, for some reason, this game, the combat, the way, the dodging and everything, uh, it reminds me of the gameplay of Gears. And I've never played one on PC. I played all of them on uh, Xbox. So now that I'm thinking about that, I feel like it actually might be a, a good game to, to play. And then of course you have Gears 5, which since I do have um, Game Pass, I instantly get access to that. So that um, that would be cool too. So. Thinking about playing Gears 4 for the first time in preparation for Gears 5, and then Gears 5 drops, I'll play that also. Um, not really, uh, maybe play some multiplayer. I've, I've never really been one for multiplayer style, but I mean, maybe with mouse and keyboard and the shotgun gameplay, I could possibly get into it. Um, I'd definitely try out uh, horde mode because I do really like the fact, um, and I know it's kind of weird, but I love the fact that there's going to be um, 